we are again looking at SQL for financial engineering. Before I move ahead, uh, let me talk a little bit about what we have been doing. So this is an introduction course uh, for SQL. In case uh, you want to use FQL, SQL, you've got two options: My SQL, Oracle SQL, Microsoft SQL. Uh, there were some problems that I faced with the SQL installation. I've talked about that. I'm not going to go there again, but I'll talk about some of the other things here the, that I studied, and I, I tend to keep on forgetting them when you don't use SQL. So I am going to take you through with uh, some important links here of uh, the SQL interviews. Now, in case you don't have time, or there has been time when you actually did SQL. Or even in the case when you have never studied SQL, these interviews would be helpful. So I am referring to a site called dwbiconcepts.com. The question here is that what is the difference between inner and outer join? So inner is the most simple join, which is used to combine the rows from table and create a resultant set only uh, for things that are in both tables based on joining condition. An outer join will uh, return matching rows for as well as unmatched row. Now, the difference between join and union, union and union, all <coughs> and these top que uh, 20 questions. So, uh, the first uh, place to start with are these 20 questions. Let's move to another question. So, this is a site called IndiaBigs.com, uh, and then there are some questions. So many of those questions are still tricky. I'm not sure how this would work. And then you have 10 frequently asked SQL query interview question from Java 67 or Block 4000. So uh, find the second highest salary of an employee, select max salary for salary, not in select max salary employee and these are some type of questions that you can get. Then you have a site called programmer interview and uh, there are, are a list of questions here like uh, secondary key, simple key, uh, super key, what's reference integrity having versus where clause, data mining, SQL injection and these are really some questions that uh, you can find and that would be important. So that was a very quick overview about uh, the types of question. Now I'm going to move uh, uh, to how to practice them and how to use the book uh, in the Quant Finance interview. So uh, the book that we have here or one way to prepare for this is uh, the 7461 exam. And let's look at that and the syllabus uh, that we can get from here. So. I, I will just go there and open the syllabus for you to help you understand what we have there. So again this syllabus is, uh, uh, is reference uh, from a website. So it starts with uh, understanding how this works using the select case man, distinct using column, alias and case. So this is like module 1. Coring with joints, inner joints, outer joints, sorting the data. Then you have group by having derived data, then you have view, set operator, uh, executed store procedure and this is one way. So I got this from let's all dot Asia. I guess there is a course in uh, Mumbai in India somewhere where they have prepared this course. So this is uh, another way to look at that. So I hope uh, this was good enough to give you a slight idea about the SQL uh, interview questions. Thank you for listening.